so I got so much great feedback about that five minute squat challenge that I'm gonna give you guys another one. So we're just gonna ramp it up one minute here and go into a six minute squat challenge. This is gonna be a great addition to another workout or maybe you are like crazy super pressed in your day but you wanna do something to get this in. Maybe you'll even do it twice in one day. Overachievers, I know there's a few of you. All right, so our breaks are gonna be short and few. We're gonna hustle and we're gonna get this done quickly because I know everyone wants to maximize time. So really quick before we start, I wanna hit a few key things up about your squat. I want you to make sure when you go down, your hips and butt are going back and you can wiggle your toes. I don't care how quick we're going or what position we're really in for that squat. If you can't wiggle your toes, you're leaning too far forward on your squat. Your hips and your butt need to be back, okay? So make sure your hips and your butt are back on your squats. So we're going to start in with a narrow, wide, narrow, wide combo. It's going to be uh, quick. We're going to hustle, but get into your full range of motion. Here we go. 45 seconds, let's go. So I'm driving my hips back. My abdominals are in, okay? Hips are back, abs are tight, shoulders are back. I'm not rounding out my back when I go forward. Good, let's make this count. You got it. Good, down and up, push those hips back. Good, keep it going. How low can you go? Get to your full range of motion. I'm moving arms for double duty cardio here. If you're a little wobbly, you can go hands to hips. All right, that's gonna help with your balance. Good, come on, five seconds. Drop your hips. Good, push your hips back. Maybe you need to slow down a little bit so you can really get to your full range of motion. I'd rather you do that. And rest, beautiful. Okay, tap that for a second. Don't just stand still. March, keep moving. So, our next one, we're gonna squat and in, squat and in, okay? Here we go, three, two, let's go, and up. Good, squat and up. You got it, this is a little shorter on this one, but you got it. Good, my legs are together, Whoop. <laughs> but watch it, your knees don't go out, your knees stay in together, okay? So keep it moving, you got it. Deep breaths, just say eight more seconds here. Good, keep it going. All the way. <laughs> I'm getting a little uncoordinated to talk and move here at the same time. A few seconds and rest. Okay, here's our next move. Feet are gonna go a little wider. You're gonna squat, cross to your opposite knee. My abdominals are in nice and tight. Drive from your heels, keep the toes loose still. Here we go, three, two, let's go. Drop those hips, hold those abs tight. Good, this is some great standing ab work right here. Get all the way, down and up. Come on, deep breaths. Drive that knee up. Get all the way to that squat though. Do not shorten your range of motion on your squat. Beautiful, you got it. Good, all the way down. Good, all the way. Deep breaths, woo, keep it going. He's got about 10 more seconds. Good, keep it moving, keep it moving. Drive that knee up. Good, cross that elbow. Rotate for that upper body and rest. Beautiful, okay. We're going back to the beginning, out and in, out and in. We got 30 seconds on this one. That first one was 45. So it's gonna be just a little shorter. You got this though, all right? So here we go. Start narrow and down and wide. Good. Remember if you have to, slow it down so you get into that full range of motion. I don't want little baby squats because you're trying for speed. All the way down. Watch as you travel that you don't lunge it. Keep the weight even. Okay, again, you may need to slow it down a little so that you've got that control. Last three seconds. I'm on. Two and up. Okay, take just a second. Tap it out. Okay, we got our taps. This one's 45. It's longer, but you got this. There we go. Three, two, let's go. Tap and up. Good. 
Okay, you got it. Good. All the way down. Abdominals in. Remember, if you're wobbly, hands to hips. Good. My chest is up. My shoulders are back. I'm pushing my butt behind me, though. Okay? Beautiful. Make this count. You got it. Good. All the way down. All the way up. Keep it going. Beautiful. Beautiful. We only got like 10 seconds left. That's it. Beautiful. Good. Last five seconds. Four, three. We can do one more each side. Two, one, and rest. Okay. We got that knee to opposite elbow. I'll give you just a second because I want you to be able to give me your all. So I'm giving you these short little rests. Here we go. In three, two, and down. Come on. Cross to that opposite knee. Beautiful. Drive that knee up. Abs in tight. Good. Good. All the way up. Come on. Drive those hips back. Get down low. Beautiful. Come on. Deep breaths. You got it. You got it. You got it. Keep it moving. We are well over two-thirds of the way done. For those of you that don't like math, we're well over four minutes done. <laughs> you got it. Come on. Down and up. Ten seconds left. Beautiful job. Come on. Good. All the way. Three, two, one, and rest. All right. We're going back to the beginning. It's going to stay a short one. You got it. So we're going for our travels. Out and in. I'll give you a few more seconds. Don't stand still, though, during these little rests. Remember, you're moving your feet. Here we go. Three, two, and go. So narrow and wide. Good. Drop the hips. Good. Weight in your heels. Once you wiggle those toes, give yourself a test run. Can you wiggle those toes? Can you wiggle those toes? Beautiful. Keep it going. It's your last one of these. Come on, my abs are in. I'm making sure I use my core right now by pulling my belly button up and in and keeping it there as I squat. So those muscles are working right now. Good, last five seconds. You can do it. Three, two, and rest. Okay, so this is our last one with our toe tap. We are gonna hold that squat. You can do this. It is your last one. It's only 30 seconds, okay? If you absolutely cannot, and I'm trusting you to push yourself, then go ahead and do our come up, down to your squat, and tap, okay? Like we have been doing, but otherwise, I want you to challenge yourself. Here we go. Three, two, and down, and tap it. Come on. 30 seconds. Keep the hips and the butt down. Dominals in. You can do this. My shoulders are back. My abs are in. Beautiful. Come on. Keep it going. Deep breaths. Good. You got it. Come on. You want to challenge? Hold those arms up. Let's go. You can do it. Come on. Keep it going. Keep it going. If you're wobbling, hands to hips. Last six seconds. Woo! Feeling good, right? Good. Last four. Three, two, and rest. We've got our very last one we've done. Look how fast this went. Isn't this awesome? And you did a lot, a lot of work. So we got squat to opposite knee. Here we go, last one. Take it down, drive it up. Remember, I'm holding my abdominals in. Every time that knee and elbow come together, it's like a crunch. So pull those abs in tight. Beautiful. You got this. Woo, feeling good, right? Deep breaths. You got like 15 seconds left, that's it. We can do this. Push those hips back. How low can you go? Come on, last 10 seconds. Drop those hips. Beautiful. Keep it going. Three, two, we're good to the end. I want to get one more each side. Give me one more each side. And done. That was six minutes of squats. That is awesome work. Give yourself a pat on the back because you also got a lot of other work in as well. So, nice job. I know my heart rate's going. If yours is, make sure you walk around. Don't just go sit down. So, march, walk around the house. Get a big glass of water. Eat something good and healthy. 
and have a happy, healthy day. Again, if you guys are liking these quick ones, make sure you let me know so I know which ones you guys want to see more of, okay? All right, thanks for joining me. Have a happy, healthy day.